More than a million people so far have seen a very hateful incident caught on tape at the Dillard's at North Park in Dallas. It shows a customer confronting a clerk and responding calmly after that clerk called his 10 year old son a racist, racist slur. Our Robbie Owens is speaking exclusively tonight with the father. Mohammed Kareem lives a quiet life in Johnson County. He says he visited the Dillard's that day just to buy a shirt and some pants. He's not even that active on social media, but now as he becomes the latest internet sensation, it's relevant to say that he is doing so, delivering a lesson in grace. That of what you did. It was hate caught on tape. The impact of what you've done to my son. But what appears to have caught the internet's eye was not just a Dillard's clerk hurling a racist slur at a 10 year old. Tear came out my baby's eye and he said that you didn't hear what that man just called me. It was how calmly his father responded. Mohammed Kareem admits it wasn't easy and credits his faith. The Prophet Muhammad said, Don't be angry. Don't be angry. Don't be angry. And I'll be honest with you, I was angry. I was I was livid. And he didn't buy the clerk's explanation that he had hit his leg. You don't go from hitting your foot to doesn't life doesn't work that way this is repetitive behavior the employee told kareem that he had worked at dillard's for more than 20 years but no more in response to our questions dillard's provided this statement saying quote the allegations made against our former employee were promptly investigated found to be in clear violation of our standards and his employment with dillard's was immediately terminated we're sorry he's fired. Okay, let's move on. I see it's 10. Kareem says his son has been traumatized. He think every white person is out to get him. His wife also overheard the slur and is struggling as well. And Kareem admits, so is he. I can't allow for my situation. I can't allow for my feelings and my emotions to, uh, overshadow them at this particular time so i'm i'm doing the best that i can to protect them but the trauma just as he did that day in dillard's the best decision was at, at that moment was to just do uh what was right in johnson county robbie owens cbs 11 news